takes two, where we're slowly creeping towards Halloween weekend. And to get you in the mood, we'll be revealing some frighteningly good songs in Tunes on Tuesday. Plus, Natalie Lowe returns for more Choreography Corner. Woo! What a joy. But now, let's see who's lurking in the green room. They have quick-stepped across town to be here tonight. Johnny and Oti! The locks that the main is down, and they've managed to survive the dreaded dance of Simon and Karen. Yay! Gorgeous. Now, seeing as if you're both fit as a fiddle and ready for love, uh, let's see how quickly they can peg it over for a quick chat. Ready? Go. In the meantime, here's another look at their cheeky Charleston. <laughs> I thought it was massively entertaining. You sped up in the middle of the music and you actually managed to keep up. The recipe was missing some ingredients. You actually looked a little nervous. The train step, you were in perfect time in the situation. And I love the slapstick end. Jenny Hayden loved it. So many carrots! Can I say, firstly, uh, as beautiful as your outfits are, I'm sad you're not in matching outfits. Like, oh, I think that's the yeah, way they're forward the for you dry two. cleaner. Oh, yeah. I loved it. Well, oh. I sort of said on Saturday, can I said, Joe, I actually better pull my socks if I look like you tonight, I should try and dance like you. <laughs> I know, exactly. Oh, you were glorious, though. And then your second dance off, you see, you've done it before. Oh, we're so veterans. You know what yeah. you're doing, surely. We actually like a dance yeah. off. Yeah. We're, kind of, we're, we're hoping for that every week. No, we week, don't. Maybe. Don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> it um, was weird, though, because it, it did feel different. I think because yeah. you know what the emotion is. Okay. Then you kind of go, right, okay, we've just got to focus and, you know, do what we do. And, it, and you did. You did what you do and you did it very well. Um, Karen, the thing is, there's so many couples with the same score there. Yeah. You look at, are looking, everyone's looking at that leaderboard thinking, oh, this could be yeah. tricky. I mean, it could have been anybody. Yeah. You know, and that's the thing. And, and it did look weird seeing all the 16s. We got a 16, huh? <laughs> um, but, but at the same time, you know, it's one of those things that you just accept. Yeah. And you kind of just go, hey, it's, if it's us, it's us. And, you know, we're going to go out there and, yeah. and do our best. And also, we were really excited because we got to see that again. And it was joyous. Oh, um, that was, and it's, it is a bittersweet thing. I always feel for the couple who, who stay in because you can't do, yeah, yeah. Woo, because your friend's going home. It's yeah, and Brian is one. a proper friend. I mean, you know, yeah. I, I basically said that I have actually now won the lumbering old bloke glitter ball. Because <laughs> basically it was Richard, myself and Brian as the yeah. three lumbering old guys. And I'm actually the last one one standing oh. but it is a real shame because Brian's so much fun yeah. you know around the place you know he's just a proper laugh and you I know, know bless him I, I will miss him terribly I know it and, and it's strange sort of hearing people say that but you do get so close and it does feel quite odd when one when one of you's gone the swivel your Achilles heel <laughs> you poor love um and and then they said you go off and practice on the other leg because you, you know, like like I haven't um, practiced this I know yeah, I know, but do you know what? It was, it was good. I like the fact, because they, they think again before the dance-off, and the judges give you good advice. I thought, yeah. right, OK, let's give it a go. So we practised beforehand. And, yeah, I mean, you know, there was a bit of swivel. I was like, please, just... Just, 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 just <laughs> whack it around! Just, just, <laughs> let it shake! It's <laughs> easy. It's a hard thing to it's, master. It's and... extremely yeah. hard. I mean, literally, go up on your... If you're at home right now, yeah. get on your toes and start bringing your heels together yeah. and then try going back and forth. I can hear the With audience are doing yeah. it. I don't yes, even you are. You always pull up. All Why are you all better than me? <laughs> <laughs> Not bad, I have to say. But the great thing is that Craig did point out that whatever you're lacking in swivel, he absolutely loved the slapstick charm, Simon. Yes. <laughs> well done. Um, was, that, was that a joy to do? It was season? such fun. It was my favourite dance that we've done so yes. far. And the end bit from when Karen jumps on my back and the music ups a, ups a beat. <laughs> yeah. It, we just couldn't stop <laughs> laughing right the way through rehearsals all the last week. It just made us laugh non-stop and had, I loved it and just, you know it was <laughs> it was so much fun. Yeah, it was. We just had crazy eyes. Yeah. Like our eyes just opened up and we're like -na 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 -na. Yeah. <laughs> it was it was insane. Uh, we loved it. Oh, we really, really loved yeah, it. it really uh, speaking of crazy eye, uh, the eagle eye viewers amongst you may have spotted Karen tucking into a rather unusual snack when our Claude and <laughs> the voting <laughs> was open. Woman, is there anything you won't eat? I <laughs> you are brilliant.
brilliantly mad. I love flowers. <laughs> you do. Edible flowers. Absolutely. Unedible oh, flowers. flowers. <laughs> I know. She'll eat the lot. Yeah, whatever it is. Uh, there was a little slip when you did the dance-off. Did you think, oh, curtains, the little whoop? Yeah, it was really weird. I don't, I don't know why, you know, we've done that so many times. And I did slip, and the thing that I'm kind of quite happy with is the fact I didn't miss a beat. I was still on time. <laughs> you didn't even know I didn't it slipped. Had, I had, didn't, had no idea. I just saw his face, and he was like... <laughs> and I'm like, something must have happened. Because I was, my back was to him, and he just went, and I'm like, I don't know that no, smile. We haven't practiced that smile. So, but I, you know, but he came in and he he went through with it, you know, through with it yeah. like a pro. That means you're dealing with things like a pro. This yeah. is good. It's his progress. <laughs> oh goodness me! It's like when a child's done something and like I've done nothing. <laughs> um, you've got your thigh strapped up. Yes, this I This is have, Simon, so not we... Karen. Um, <laughs> look, what's happened and what on earth is happening there? So that is from uh, from the slip. And yeah. basically, I've got a bit of pain in my quad. So um, my lovely physio, Doug, has yeah. kind of strapped me up to kind of just keep um, keep the muscle in place and <gasps> hopefully kind of, you know, it'll, it'll sort itself out. Thank goodness for Doug. This Is this something that you get used to, Karen? Yeah, I mean, but it is really tough because these guys have never danced before and, and the amount of uh, the muscular, you know, it's, it's pretty intense on, on you muscles you know, in your muscles. So if something like that happens, it's really hard to rec um, recover from it. But hopefully you'll be OK. Yeah, yeah. Fingers crossed. Yeah. It's yeah. very, yeah. very intense. Yeah. Whatever it takes, Simon, I've whatever very it brave takes. Soldiers, I mean. You have been a very brave... Yeah. You get a treat at the end Thank of the you. show. Um, <laughs> it's a Viennese waltz for you two for Halloween to a Tom Jones classic, Delilah. Bye, yes! Bye. Have you been able to start training yet? With no. your leg and everything? Uh, yeah. No, uh, it, this has got to calm down a little bit, really. So uh, that, that is the only thing we've not been able to start yet. This has got to be eased off a little bit. Oh, gosh, does that worry you, Karen? A little bit. Okay. Yeah, I mean, because then that leaves us two days mm. to two really days put everything fine. together. So, But, you know, he's a hard worker and he, he's very focused. So I'm, I'm OK yeah. for now. She seems <laughs> calm. She seems very calm. <laughs> um, <laughs> swamping. Will there be food involved in this Routine, Karen. How I don't did know. you know? I, do, How I did just know? kind of figured. Lucky I don't guess. know. Yes, I mean we're gonna have food. We're gonna have a banquet. Oh, oh. yes, him and I feasting. <laughs> like there'll probably be one sandwich left by the time she's been at it in rehearsals. <laughs> 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 Listen, good luck with the leg. Thank good you. luck with the Viennese walls, and well done. I'm getting through to Halloween. Bless sure. you. Thank you. Uh, Simon and Karen. <laughs> Goodness for Doug. Now, Halloween week is arguably the greatest of all theme weeks, which means we've got the playlist to match. As the youth would say, it's all killer, no filler. Uh, it's time for a spooky edition of Tunes on Tuesday. They did the mash. They did the monster mash. The monster mash. It was a graveyard smash. They did the mash. Oh, I love this one. The jukebox. Look at it. It's only been in storage for a week, covered in cobwebs. How very Halloween-y. Uh, we've got a week of this, everyone, so just hold tight. Let's hope it's still working. Here we go. Ooh, it's Frankie by disco legend's Sister Sledge, released in 1985. It was the group's only UK number one, spending four weeks at the top of the charts. And can you guess which famous Frankie the song was about? Frank Bruno. No, not Frank Bruno. No, not Dottori. It was, in fact, Frank Sinatra. I've no idea what's going on around me here. Uh, who's hoping to dance a memorable routine to this? You're right there, love. You're right. Oh. Oh, please, oh! <laughs> Debbie and Giovanni will be dancing at Charleston. As you can see, no expense spared on that mask. Uh, thank you very much, you two. Uh, right, what's next on the Halloween soundtrack? Here we go. <gasps> it's the theme from popular 60s sitcom <laughs> Bewitched, about a witch who's... <laughs> Married to an ordinary man, but simply can't resist using her powers. That's the scariest cackle I've ever heard in my life. Do you want that back, love? Uh, so the show, Elizabeth Montgomery was famed for her magic nose wiggle. But if you look, oh, that's quite nice. If you look closely, you'll see that her nose isn't really moving at all. It's her mouth. That is. Oh. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Yeah, thank you. I'm so sorry. Oh, cat, lovely. Uh, who will? Oh, yes, yeah, sorry. Who will be hoping to create dance magic with this classic theme on Saturday? Use your broom, love. Oh. It's Ruth and Anton dancing.
sing a quick step. Oh, lovely witch, Karen Clifton. Uh, time for one more. We better make it a good one. Oh, it is Killer Queen by who else? Queen, released in 1974. It reached number two in the UK charts. Now, did you know that, oh, look at the poise. Freddie Mercury was a cat person and over the years shared his home with a number of feline friends. It's getting weirder and weirder. <laughs> worry about her. He couldn't bear to be apart from them, and whilst touring the world, he would regularly call his house in order to speak to his beloved pets. But who's hoping to be the cat's pajamas? Careful, pussy cat. With his song on Saturday, here we go. Oh. <laughs> yes, it's the other cat lover. Susan and your husband, I feel sorry for him. Uh, we're doing a foxtrot, we can't wait. Uh, to find out the rest of our songs, please head to the Strictly website. Now, it's always a treat. It's time to see how rehearsals are going for this weekend's group number. Somebody help me, please, help me. Quickly, help me. It's Halloween week, and this group dance is the stuff of nightmares. Watch on, if you dare. The concept of the dance is about somebody's dreams which turn to nightmares. It starts off with Brendan alone in his bedroom and then something happens. We are all hiding under the bed. It's me, Chloe, Katya and Karen. And we come out and just as Brendan falls asleep, we become his worst nightmare. I'm the Gothic Prince, and the rest of the cast are they are kind of like the, my demons in my head. Weirdly, I'm lying down for a lot of it asleep. Maybe they're trying to tell me something. This piece is a continuation of last year's performance where Brendan actually took Karen away from Kevin, and so now it's Karen getting her revenge on him. I've come back to haunt Brendan Cole. He took me away from my loved one, my lover, and now I've come back for revenge. There's a really tingly moment within this number and the entire cast of dancers, we all throw our hands up in the air. It's very powerful to watch. That's all we can show for now. But guys, don't have nightmare. Don't be scared because ghosts are not real. Yeah.